using the identity find the value of 103 the whole square. First let's revise the identity. We know a plus b the whole square equal to a square b square plus 2ab. Now here we have 103. Now this 103 can be written as 100 plus 3 the whole square. That is a, this would be our a and this would be our b. So this a plus b the whole square is a square plus b square plus 2ab. We know our a is 100 and our b is 3. So a is 100 and b is 3. So a square b square 2ab. 100 square is 100 into 100. 3 square 9 and here we have 600. And then when we add this up we get 10609 which means 103 the whole square which is 103 into 103 equal to 10609. In the second sum we will find the square of 105 the whole square which means we need to find 105 into 505. Again we use the formula a plus b the whole square. And a plus b the whole square is a square plus b square plus 2ab. So this is 505 and 505 will break it up into 100 plus 5 the whole square. This is a and this is our b. So we have a as 500 and b as 5. So we do a square plus b square 2ab. So for a we put 500, this is b square 2, this is our a and this is our b. Now 500 into 500 is 2500 and 00. See we just do that again. So we have 500 into 500, we'll do 5 into 5 which is 25 and then you have your four zeros. So 5 square 25 and uh, here we'll have so when you add this up you get 255025 which means now 505 the whole square is 255025. In the next sum, we'll find the value of 97 square, which means it is 97 into 97. For this, we will use the formula a minus b the whole square. That is a square plus b square minus 2ab. So a minus b the whole square. So for 97, we are going to write as 100 minus 3 the whole square. So this would be our A and this would be our B. So we have A equal to 100, B equal to 3. So A plus B the whole square is A square. This is A minus B the whole square. A square plus B square. So that is B square. 2AB. Now we know our A is 100 and our B is 3. So we have 100 square, this is B square, 3 square, 2AB, 100 and 3. So this is 100 into 100 is, we'll have 4 zeros, 9 minus 600. And the answer is 9409 and 97 square, 9409. We'll now find 298 the whole square, which means it's 298 into 298. For this, uh, again, we use the formula, our identity A minus B the whole square, which is A square 
plus b square minus 2ab. So we now do 298. 298 will be 300 minus 2 the whole square, which is a square, b square, minus 2ab. Here this is our a, so our a is 300 and this is our b, so b equal to 2. So where there is a, this is a square, this is b square, 2ab. So here we will now put in the a and b values. So we know a is 300, b is 2, a 300, b 2. So 300 into 300 will be 9 with 4 zeros. Then we have 4 minus 12, 0, 0. When you work this out, you get 8, 8, 8, 0, 4. Remember you need to add these two and then subtract 1, 2, 0, 0.